In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the routing function in Dehumanizer Pro and show you examples of custom workflows. The routing function is a matrix that allows you to route the effects in your own way and customize your workflow. To open the routing matrix, go to the advanced mode and click on the routing icon. This window contains all the effects that Dehumanizer includes in a list and allows you to send a percentage of the signal to another effect or to the system output. Have in mind that each effect channel has its own fader that has to be open in order to function. By clicking on the Reset to Parallel option, the connection becomes parallel and all the effects send the signal to the output, as shown in this diagram. The signal goes from the input to every effect and then to the output in a parallel connection. As a result, if we have all the effects active, there will be 11 sound layers that pass through our stereo output, similar to having 11 different tracks that play simultaneously on our DAW. The next example shows how to connect some of the effects in a serial connection instead of a parallel. To achieve that, we will start from the input and send the signal to the pitch shifting, then to the noise generator, then to the granular effect, then to the delay pitch shifting, and finally to the stereo output. The arrows show the signal flow. Now we need to make sure that the faders are open. Delay pitch shifting is the last effect before the output. As a result, because our connection is serial, if we close the fader, the signal will not reach the output. The output sound is noisy because it passes through the noise generator to the other effects in a serial connection. Now, let's try another serial connection. First, we will send the signal from the input to the granular effect. Then, we will find the granular effect and send the signal to the noise generator. From the noise generator to the pitch shifting. And from the pitch shifting to the stereo output. The arrows show the signal flow. The Dual Plugins component allows you to use up to two VST instruments or audio units in your workflow. If you click on the Pre option, the routing connects the plugin component before the effects. As a result, the signal goes from the input to the chosen plugins and then from every effect to the output. The Post option connects the plugins at the end of the workflow. As a result, the signal passes through every effect, then goes through the VST component and then to the output. In case you have a plugin that doesn't affect the signal significantly, a gentle reverb for example, close the dual plugins fader to avoid having the dry signal in the output. These were just some examples of how you can use the routing system to create a custom workflow in Dehumanizer Pro. You can try combinations of serial and parallel connections and create unique effects for your projects. Yeah.